round up these studies measure the difference between a control group, those who haven't seen the advertising, and an exposed group, those who have. And it's important when you're looking at those groups that there's no bias, for example, in the research. So you have to make sure that your control group is balanced for age, gender, acceptability to advertising, and also category and brand usage. But it's also important to test when you get the delta between the two groups that that result is a reliable result. So what statistical significance measures is how reliable that is. It helps quantify whether the result is something that's happened purely because someone's been exposed to the advertising or it's happened by chance or sampling error. You can test at different significance levels. At on-device research, we test at the highest level, which is 95% confidence level. And what this means is if we repeated the study 100 times with the same campaign, we'd expect 95 times the results to be exactly the same. And if you test at that level and it's seen to be significant, it means it's a really robust finding. So what does statistical significance mean in relation to reading a brand impact report? So for an end user using the report, if something is seen to be statistically significant, whether that's up or down, it means it's a really reliable finding and can actually be used to inform business decisions. So in brand applet studies, for example, it can inform which creative works best, which platform works best, which media channel works best, what is your best target audience, and are you using the right targeting technique? And just to say again, at on-device research, we test everything at a 95% confidence level, which means that if we repeated the study 100 times, 95 times we'd expect the same result. Thank you, Sarah, that's really useful. We hope you found this short video useful, but if you do have any other questions on statistical significance, then please do let us know or contact us at ondeviceresearch.com.